going on guys? Spare here today, and today we're going to be reacting to Princess Trixie Sparkle, and this time we're going to be reacting to episode 6, Trixie's Gala. Well, in the last one, it was kind of a strange one, honestly. Uh, I think we've basically rounded up the story arc where basically every pony is trying to learn each other. Like, because they're swapped in bodies, you know, so they're trying to learn each other. Uh, we also learned that Discord had... In he had the tickets all along and could have just provided it, but instead, he has to hold off on it and let them learn the hard way. So, where that's going, I have no clue. Uh, also, uh, Applejack had to save... Well, Applejack is flu as Fluttershy, sorry, had to uh, save uh, Mary Medley's butt. I can't remember her character's name, but yeah. Uh, <clears throat> so I just got done reacting to episode 6, so I am looking forward to this one. Hopefully this, like, really starts to move the story along, because it's kind of been stuck in one area, really, for too long. So I'm hoping that this brings a new part to the story that's going to make it a little bit more interesting. I'm aware it's 11 parts long, so we've still got 5 to go. So I have no idea where the story's going. But Luna is on... Trixie's butt. She knows that something ain't right. She can see that there is coincidences, like she is on the hunt for five ponies and one dragon. So, that's very coincidental, don't you think? Especially considering there's only one dragon in Ponyville who basically is allowed there. So, yeah. And again, if someone can comment below when what seasons this actually takes place in, like, from what season forward? Because I can't tell if Discord is reformed, slightly reformed, or if he's just a jerk. I don't know. I've never really been a Discord fan. So, I guess without further ado, let's just get in, get into it. I hope that I will be able to hear this one a little better. That was the problem with episode 5. I couldn't hear it very well. So, hopefully the heater doesn't kick on, because then I have to turn it up to hear it. Um, and I don't want to wash your guys' eardrums out. So anyways, let's get to it. Three, two, one, starting now. Episode 6, Trixie's Gala. Looks like the gates are open now. We best get a move on. At least one disaster actually came through for us this time. I would have much rather seen these designs on the runway, so but... So, did they get the tickets? Just cheers. Ooh, really like this artwork. Why is Pinky like pulling up like Pinky tails? Oh, that is hilarious. He's a boy though. <laughs> That's different. Again, this isn't key three Ramo Dash we're talking here, Rarity. Stop trying to eat the jewels. <laughs> Will you two oh. get off already? It's not the clothes that are important. Sorry, I'm still adapting to who is who here. Um, are the Wonder Bolts going to help you? Wait a minute, is that a reference to... I need double check now. Oh, 
in the world? Uh, what? is it a cockatrice? Oh my god. <laughs> oh wow, Spike is or Rainbow Dash in this case is just getting freaking oh. Seeing already like that is weird. Unless you'd rather be a chicken. Oh, come on. Oh, magpie. Seriously, the puns. Rarity, cook being a drama queen, please. Thank you. I really like this intro. <laughs> And it's Purple Roslyn. I'm not sure if she does pony voices much anymore. She's like the living Rainbow Dash. Sorry, the only song I'm part of the song I know. Let the adventure begin. Friendship through the cows then. Oh, oh, oh. Let the adventure begin. <laughs> All right. Oh no. Ugh, looks like Trixie's beefed up security around here. But how will Rainbow get into the gardens now? I can't fly right now. We're out and caught. Discord. Why didn't you just take the tickets? Back? No. Well, I don't see any weak spots over here, and I can't climb this thing, so I guess I don't have to wear this after all. Oh, I'm dear. Have to make a plan B. He's gonna be a distraction. We don't need to go through the hedge. There isn't enough time to tunnel Poor under. Rainbow Dash. You're gonna be a distraction, buddy. Or she. Ouch. Ouch. Oh my god. You're really that stupid. Just who do they think they are? I think it would have been more uh, creative to use a cockatrice. Come on, everypony. There's no That's what I thought it was. Good luck, Rainbow. You too, Applejack. Alright, what's gonna happen? See you, Derpy. Oh wait, that's not Derpy. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, hey, Pitch. Hey, Purple. Hey, Mag. Hey, Scribbler. And hey, uh, Pinky Rose. Come on, step inside of the gallows. There's Lost. Very madly. Uh, wow, looks like I'm a sex mother. Kind of funny because this is years before, uh, Season 7. Emo Gak. 
believe that's turning turning now pony ears. Funny how emo Gak is greeting Twilight because she voices Twilight. Oh, she's just bathing in the glory. Trixie, I mean. There's Rachel. Yeah, right. What is this song? I've heard this song before. She can take the stress, clean up our messes, and she just so wonderful. All the praises Uh, that's the one with the colorful name was uh. Uh, God damn it! The voice actor for uh, Spitfire. <clears throat> is that is that lost? Is that a pun? Twilight doesn't bathe in gloriness. That's a dead giveaway, it's not Twilight. I'm guaranteeing one of those freaking uh, singers is Pitch. Shut up! Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Thank you for it's one of those Inkpot songs, isn't it? It's the first one. I want to say it was that. I, I, I want to I say it was that song. Ship in the background. Uh, that's actually a good point. She's never been to a gala, I don't recall anyway. Even a oh god, Prince Blue Balls. So did she? Discord. Exactly. That's not one of Twilight's best friends. It's more Rainbow's best friends. Again, when this was put together depends on, you know, how candid it is. Excuse me. Oh, so the Wonderbolts know her weakness. Hello, Lost. No. Seriously? <laughs> Very medley. Pitch, Rachel. Pinky Rose, Scribbler. What are you 
doing? Is that... Oh, there's a... What's her face? Luna. There she Hi, is. No, hiding there's in the shadows. No I don't like this oh! Uh, this is... I think this is Tourniquet. I mean, that's a really nice job. I believe that's Tourniquet. Am amazing song. Amazing album. Oh, is that Estelle? No, that's gotta be Luna. That's Estelle. That's Estelle. That is not Luna. I just got good taste in music. Thank you, Luna. There's Princess right there. I gotta take this off. It's freaking hot in here. That's Estelle. I believe this is a reference to uh, Castlevania. <clears throat> I think it's Tourniquet. I'm 100% I'm sure it's Tourniquet. It's Evanescence, definitely. Hopefully this does not copyright strike me. Ooh. Nice fla nice flash effect. Epileptics be warned. Is the painting watch or the glass thing glass watching you? Thank you, Princess Luna. Wait a minute, who's on the garden? <laughs> I couldn't see. Excellent song choice. Oh wait, no, it wasn't Tourniquet, it was... Oh no, it was... I want to say it was like Fallen, if I'm not mistaken, that's what the name of that song is. It's not the Fallen album. That's not a bad idea. It'll be easier to get around without these gowns. Uh... Uh... No, no, Pinky, no. Splinter Cell? No! That's Splinter Cell referencing. Did you find her, Rainbow? Oh, god damn it, the heater's turning on. Oh, 
Is that a celestial lock or something? Oh, Princess Luna's helping him out. How did Best oh, princess. Well, it, it was, I swear. Best I, fucking I, I princess. It for you or something. <laughs> right. This this won't even be advertised, so I'm not worried about it. It's Luna. Oh, blowtorch spike. Oh god. I'd actually like to be the dragon. Which way should we go? Up or down? Uh I think up. Why up? Because the princess is always locked in the I'm gonna pause. She's got just as much power as Trixie does, so Trixie can't really foil her at all. Ooh, I've never seen this part of the castle before. B. I just love the decor. Something's so watching them too, the something dark. Songs, don't you think? Estelle. Um, Rarity, are you sure we're going the right way? To tell you the truth, I have absolutely no idea, darling. I wish I had my horn. At least then we could see where we were going. Hold on, what is this? Those colorful lanterns look as if the fire was stitched to the fabric itself, like magic. Oh, like how I magic. wish I had my sketch pad. Can you imagine having a dress Rarity, pad stop, with something please. like this? Wait, what's this? A flaw in the fabric, perhaps? Ah. Some pony unstitched it there. How dreadful. A beautiful piece like this deserves to be mended. Uh, <gasps> something's watching you. Probably because it's not... Probably because something's not right about it. Um, Rarity, do you think maybe we could find a way out of here now? What do you mean? Um, I think we're locked in here. Oh, typical. Just typical. A gust of I guess this is a Scooby-Doo reference. That's Estelle. <clears throat> I know that's like the main antagonist of the entire thing. But that's all I know. Don't worry, Twilight. It'll be all over soon. Hamora. <laughs> okay, what idiot leaves the key in the lock? Mentally, she did. Uh-huh. He's attending the gala. Escape? Sugar, we didn't escape from anywhere. We just came looking for you. Trixie told me she had all of you locked away. Why that good for nothing, slimy, backstabbing. Twilight, we were so worried. 
<laughs> nice sensor. Nice sensor. No, she didn't. I'm sure the princess would believe us if we told her what she's done. Aha, uh -huh. we would not assume that Twilight Sparkle. Princess Best Luna? princess out there. She's not stupid. What is that face? Uh. Yep. Where do we start? Yeah, Trixie. Okay, so this took place before Trixie's return, which was season six. So season four and five probably is when this takes place. Attack! Let go of me, you brutes! You're not fooling anyone. <laughs> what are you gonna do to me, princess? Kill you. <laughs> you losing your precious body, now would you? I'm not going to do anything. You are going to switch us back and face the consequences of your actions. <laughs> well, well, well. Luna. Don't mess with a princess that has been around for a thousand years. Yikes. No, you Never don't. Had to know what it felt like to be hated, outcast, and unwanted. You brought it on yourself. You everything you wanted. Luna, I do something. You can't make me give you back. That's it. I can't take this anymore. Blow fire. Get away from me. Rainbow. There's it. St stay back. I'm warning you. Five against one. Was that a pun? Huh? Oh, 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 yeah, that's right. A few minutes li earlier. Lost. Well, let's see, what happened? That's a stell. Did you hear that? Ooh, really nice oh, job on this artwork. I really like the textures. How pointless it was to be afraid of the Pony Sisters castle in the Everfree Forest. Well, that was a creepy old castle, but this is the Canterlot Castle. There's no reason to fear the holes in this place. Well, 
Are we gonna find I finally find out who Estelle is? Like what this character actually is and who they what their purpose is. Uh-huh. Uh no. It's a trap! It's a trap! Wait a minute, is Estelle a lost princess? Like, a princess that... Though a shadow I may be, I assure you, I belong to no princess. Get out! Oh, come on! Oh, come on. That is adorable. Okay, what was the song? I know it's Evanescence for sure. Wait, and a voice Twilight and Rarity? I catch that cameo because I don't know what her uh, OC looks like. What if I could, that's what I was trying to say. <sighs> Got that one to a mouthful of say. Okay, that's not Tony Brown news, but Pegasus, yeah, I knew that one. That's the shadow. Okay, praises. It's it's a Disney song, yep. Suspicious. Imaginary by Evanescence. Wow. Been a while since I've actually heard that song. Okay, I don't know this. That's adorable. Was it that their like art would get mentioned or or shown? Dress designs, probably, yeah. Loopy Arts! I should have recognized that artwork. So that was, uh... Yeah, Loopy. Brittany Ackerman... Art by Flippy Rose. Interesting. Dragon Rider. I can't pronounce that. Whitney Ackerman. Of the wing. Glory of the Rain Wings. Dusk Spark. Really nice artwork. Just my voices. Adrian Von Seingler. I can't remember his name. All right. That was really, really good. Again, it did exactly what I wanted it to do. It moved to a new part of the story, a new plot, and just total, uh, just a new thing. Okay, let's talk about Estelle for a second. Estelle, I believe, has to do with Princess Luna, for sure, because darkness. Um, but I feel like there's a deeper story to this. 
like I feel like Estelle is going to be something that was either one part of Princess Luna or two had something to do with um something to do with like a third royal royal one like maybe another like a king or a queen or maybe something like that it's a bo it's a male apparently so i didn't expect that i thought Estelle was a girl um <clears throat> kind of looks like a mixture of king sombra and it's say but lost <laughs> But Estelle is an alicorn, so it could have been, it could be one of, like, Luna's personalities, or it could be maybe, an, maybe, like, some sort of, like, some sort of part of her, like the Tantibus, that is an evil part that sways her and was locked away forever. Like, I don't know why all of a sudden it decided to pop up when they went into the towers. I still think it's linked to the crystal. The thing that Trixie used to actually uh, change Twilight and them. I don't know the origins of that yet. Well, we don't know the origins of that yet. Some of you probably do because you've seen the whole thing. But I am so looking forward to watching the next episode. I'm probably just going to watch it right after this because, yeah, it's going to be good. Uh, anything else to classify on? Luna's best princess. Honestly, she wasn't stupid. She didn't see through Trixie's tricks. God damn, that was a bad pun. But, great song choice. Boy, nostalgia throwback. I mean, Imaginary. I haven't heard that song in forever. That is definitely one of Evanescence's best. And definitely a really fitting choice because uh, Evanescence did, like, you know, darker but yet melodic stuff. Stuff that kind of... Uh, fit like a darker genre kind of stuff so I feel like the story is going to change up in the next one it's not just going to be what it was before it's going to start doing basically what what Remembrance did it's going to start taking a different turn as far as what the story is it's going to go from like light and happy and hilarious to dark and just I don't really know until we learn more about Estelle and what exactly he is. Might not even be a he, it could be a she, it could be an it, I don't know. But looks like some sort of corrupted, dark, like, entity. That's what I'm getting from Estelle. But apparently, it, I know it has to do with Princess Luna. Because, I don't know, it just seems linked to Princess Luna. The fact that, I like that they called that out. Princess Luna has never attended a gala. And... I never caught that in the show. Even to this day, uh, going into season 9, we have never seen Luna act like a, like an occur occurrence like that. We've never seen her at the Gang Girl and Gala. We've never seen her at the... We never saw her... We didn't see her at um, Cadence and Shining Armor's wedding. Well, current, well, Queen Chrysalis and Shining Armor's wedding. Because, well, that was specified in uh, Slice of Life when she said that she went to... Uh, she was delivering a present or something like that. Or getting a present. Something like that. I can't remember. But I am so hyped going into se episode se se 7. Blech. So, can't wait to see the next one. And I'm not sure when this will be out. I'm just doing a, a binge watch of all three of, of all these. So, I might watch 7 and then give it a break and then maybe come back to it. But I don't know. We'll see. So, yeah, this was great. Love the music track, and I love the direction that the story is going. I like that Luna isn't an idiot. Even though there, there is places in the writing that are a little weird, a little, I don't know, a little, they could have been done better. Let's just say that. But other than that, it's good so far. Really enjoying this, and seriously, Mag, why that pun? Why? Chicken? Really? Really, really, really? I'm really surprised you didn't put Spike or Rainbow Dash in a school chicken costume. But now I'm making bad jokes. Anyways, uh, anyways, guys, if you like this, make sure to like, comment, subscribe for more. Make sure you hit that bell icon if you enjoyed this because YouTube's wonky right now and you need to hit that bell icon if you want to get notified about everything that I upload. I do at least one reading per month. 
and <clears throat> well, I try, and I try to do reactions like in between. Uh, but yeah, you enjoy that, please hit that bell icon, and yeah, and I'm rambling. So anyways, guys, until the next time, happy whores, and make sure to take care. Until the next reaction, and stay safe.